I'm a doctor by training, and so ultimately what I want to do is to benefit uh, patients. If I'm able to develop a new test or even a new treatment, that can benefit basically potentially millions of uh, patients around the world. To see your research get closer and closer to application, to really being used, that should be the dream of all engineers or scientists. Well, I think that if you try to do something original, something which has not been done, then by definition it is difficult. Actually, I was um, a medical student at Oxford in the UK, so I learned about how when a woman is pregnant, she would like to know the health of her baby. But at that time, the uh, most accurate method is invasive method. Uh, basically, you stick a big needle into your uterus and that associate with it some risk. And so as a young student, I was thinking, is it possible to do away with this risk and just to develop a test which can be done from a blood sample of the mother? The challenge which I had initially is that people don't believe we could do it. But luckily, we persist and eventually we were funded and it worked. So at the moment, actually, I spend 50% of time doing the next generation of prenatal test and 50% time on cancer. So ultimately for the cancer, the goal is to develop a blood test which can screen for maybe dozens of types of cancer. The hardest part is be between theory and uh, practice, there's a long way to go. PNC can improve our current society by making uh, the experience of use, using the wireless network more pleasant. Right now, when you use wireless technology, sometimes the connection is no good. PNC can help you in that. I think for any research endeavor, the first thing is about curiosity. It piqued my curiosity, so that's why we dig into that. First of all, the idea to me was cute. It's something that I didn't think of before. We didn't think it would become a big thing, but it was a year or two later we discovered a lot of follow-up papers on PNC. So as a result, we got back in and developed it further. In terms of scaling, I think we need to find applications, so-called killer applications, that will be adopted by a wide population. And then, if a lot of people use it, our impact will be bigger. After we write a paper, how do we make an impact in society? After all, that is the ultimate dream of any researcher. There's no, no point doing some theory and stop, stop there. My advice to students who aspire to be pioneers is to try to develop an ability to look at things in a new light. Look at it, things at an angle which people haven't looked at before. Because you are going to see a lot of hurdles, meet a lot of hurdles along the way. Without passion and perseverance, you will feel down. You need to pull yourself through and only passion and perseverance can pull your way through.